Let me show you how to make this yourself. Oil your gun with deadly precision. Hey, welcome back. Vegas Ranger here. And today I wanted to share with you a little oiling tip um, that I use. And I'm going to show you how I make it. So this involves a syringe. And you can get your syringes from any feed store. You know, an animal store that sells hay, chicken feed, alfalfa, you know, for cows, you know, things like that. I live in Las Vegas and there are several feed stores in town. So I know if you live in a large city, there's a feed store someplace around. And this happens to be a 21 gauge. Um, if you want something bigger or smaller, it's going to be up to you. I use 21 gauge just because... I like how it dispenses oil. So I have the syringe right here. I'm going to go ahead and take the cap off. Be very careful because this tip is very sharp and it can puncture you. And what I'm going to do is just going to unscrew the cap. So this just unscrews from in here. Move that to the side. And I'm going to get my Dremel tool out. Now. Um, this came with several grits of sandpaper, the kit that I bought, and this is one of the, the finer grits of sand, sandpaper that I'm using. I'm not using the, the 80 grit. This looks like maybe it's 200 grit, but something fine, something not too, not too rough. And then I'm going to turn my, my Dremel on. It doesn't have to be too fast. And I'm going to take the tip. And I'm just going to grind it down. So what I'm doing is I'm holding it closer to the tip. That way it doesn't vibrate as much. I think I need to go a little faster. pretty good right there so I grinded it down to get rid of the the sharp part of the um, of the needle that would slice through your skin and now it's pretty much just it's just flat with a tiny hole on the tip and then I just um, took the edges and got rid of the burr so let me take my gloves off and check it Nice and smooth, doesn't prick my skin, so there's a nice fine hole. We'll put that to the side, put my glove back on, and then once again you're going to take the needle and you're going to screw it back on the lid. You're just going to screw it back on, make sure that it's snug. Okay. So now this ain't gonna puncture your skin. And you're gonna take your favorite oil. Sorry, it's my dog in the background. And I'm just gonna stick the needle in. And then I'm just gonna extract oil. And that's it. Now I have pinpoint accuracy with my oil and I can put as much or as little oil as I need and I don't have to waste any oil. Thanks for watching. Hope you find this useful.